Alright guys, back on my second test ride, I'm on the 2016 GSXS 1000, so essentially the Naked Jixxer 1000, uh, but it's got like a little bit less power to be, because of it's a naked bike. I gotta say, I'm pretty damn happy so far, just uh, hitting it in first gear through about 7,000 RPM to second. Ooh, she's nice. <laughs> so let's see, ow, oh, fuck. Ah, that bump really fucking hurt, but let's see how this test ride goes. I'm fucking really excited. I gotta say, the riding position's a bit more aggressive than that FZ09. I'm definitely a little hunched over more compared to my 650 seating position, but for a 1000cc fucking leader bike, I mean, that's kind of expected. Alright, guys, first impressions of getting this thing on the highway and getting her up to speed, dude. Fucking torque machine, dude. This thing's got is hella powerful, man. This bike ain't no joke. I could definitely see how, why this has a, a, G, a Gixxer 1000 motor a little bit detuned, man. I am actually am going to ride the Gixxer 1000, too, for a nice little comparison. But fuck me, dude. This shit is badass. Look at this motherfucker. I mean, I guess, what do you do when you get in a group of bikes? I mean, I guess I would really wouldn't know what to do either if I didn't actually ride a bike, you know what I mean? But... And I'm only in fourth gear, and this thing has this ridiculous fucking pull, dude. Oh, I'm so fucking happy right now. I feel like if I hit it right now, I would just fucking power wheelie in fourth. Woo! A lot really windy, though, without the windscreen. They do have a version of this with the windscreen. Uh, I might ride that one, too, but we'll just see how it goes. Woo! Oh, Billy. No Billy is all I gotta say right now. This thing is pretty damn sweet. I've never been a Suzuki guy, but this is a pretty damn nice bike, man. Pretty damn nice bike. And if I remember correctly, this this just recently came out as well. This, this is the Suzuki's kind of answer to the FZ09 type thing. But then, you know, of course, Yamaha got to them with the MT-10, so... I'm sorry, FZ10, let me say the American name. Oh. Now, I'll be keeping under a certain RPM because we can't hooligan these bikes, but... Pretty much anything after 5,000 RPM, this bike just fucking launches, dude. Oh. <sighs> Man, I should know these lights, dude. I used to live on this side of town. Uh, oh, Billy. Oh. 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 Oh, I just nutted again. Uh, uh, uh. There's nothing like that feeling when a bike gives you a boner and it makes you bust a nut. I know this is kind of gross, but a true story, bro. So the seated position on this is nice, dude. You're a little more hunched over compared to my 650. But the fucking seat, dude, is really cushiony. I cannot complain about the seat, dude. I could see me uh, put a windscreen on this. Go for a nice ride, man. I definitely would have to at least put some sort of windscreen on this to own a bike like this. Guys, now that I'm almost back to the dealership, riding the Suzuki GSX S1000. I gotta say, guys, this is a pretty sweet bike, man. This is one of the Suzuki's newer naked bikes to get into their naked class. Uh, way, 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 way more powerful than the FZ09 for sure. But this also has a bigger motor. And I believe it's an inline four compared to the inline three type thing. Oh shit, you know what I mean? But uh, I like it, it's pretty nice. Uh, I haven't ridden that many naked bikes before, but if I were to look like if I'm like a Suzuki only, or if I just want a bike like this, yeah, I'll buy one, I wouldn't mind it. It's a pretty sweet bike, man. Uh, obviously I'm gonna tell you go test ride one, but I can't really find many complaints about it. It's pretty much instant power it's got a really nice power command power command power band the seating position's really nice shifts good rides good on the highway i definitely would have to add a windscreen on this to daily the bike like i do my 650 but other than that can't really complain i'm gonna go ahead and go choose my next bike and go from there